Hi, my name is Dimitri and I'm the developer of Infranodus, a tool that can visualize any text as a network to show you the main topics, uh, the relations between them and the gaps in your knowledge. Today, I want to show a really nice feature that was requested a lot, the ability to merge different nodes into one. I'm going to show you how it works using this example. It's the visualization of the tweets from today. So for example, as you can see here, we have a, a few different topics, uh, black people, is one of them, the new Bolton book is another. Let's say it's a bit too much com complexity and we would like to simplify it. So what we can do is to select the nodes, let's say black people, and we unify it here by clicking this button into one node, give it a name, black people is fine. So then you see it becomes one node on the graph. And then if we go further and let's say we choose uh, the new Bolton book, and uh, let's say John Bolton book, unify it like this, name it Bolton book, add it, and then you see this becomes one single node in the graph. And you can actually continue doing it for as long as you want with uh, as many different topics as you would like to have. So for example, if there is a topic here about Chinese product boycott and you would like to make it one topic, then quickly click the merge button and then add it as a new graph. It's added here, you see, and then you can delete some of the things you might not need. And there you have a visualization of the topics that are the main topics for today. You can also use the filter feature to remove some of the noise and see what is the gist, the essence for today. There is a, Another possibility that you can do also is to unlock these uh, nodes that you merge together. So for example, here, if I choose black people, I can click unlock. And then what's going to happen is that this topic will be unlocked and I'm going to see these two separate terms selected on the graph so I can discover which context they appear in. And I can do the same for the rest of the stuff here. So I select the topic, unlock, and check in which context these topics appear. And finally here, select the topic, unlock. And it's going to reload, showing me the connections be between these different terms. You can also go into settings panel and set your own synonyms here. So for example, if you have some words that you want to constantly and consistently translate into uh, some specific terms, like for instance here, COVID gets translated into coronavirus and SARS-CoV-2 also gets translated into coronavirus. If you save this, then each time there is COVID or SARS-CoV in the graph, it's going to be visualized as coronavirus. So this is how it works. I hope you find this feature interesting and uh, try it out on infernodus.com. Let me know how it works. Thank you.